to the chapter acids and bases here let us perform an activity to know about neutralization reaction click each tab to know more Take a test tube, clean it using a clean dropper. Pour 10 drops of hydrochloric acid carefully in the test tube. Now, add 2 drops of phenolphthalein indicator solution. Observe the color changes. Now, add sodium hydroxide solution drop by drop to the test tube. Shake it well after adding each drop. Observe the change in the color of the solution. Keep adding the sodium hydroxide drop by drop until the color begins to turn pink. Once again, add drop by drop of hydrochloric acid to the solution mixture until the solution in the test tube becomes colorless. In this activity, we observe that there is no change in the color of hydrochloric acid while adding phenolphthalein solution. The color of the solution in the test tube becomes pink by adding a drop of sodium hydroxide solution. The pink color of the mixture solution becomes colorless by adding a few drops of hydrochloric acid. Finally, we learned that if we add excess base, that is sodium hydroxide, to acidic solution, that is hydrochloric acid, it converts to base. Similarly, we can change base into acid. We also learned that the effect of base is nullified by an acid. When acids and bases are mixed in definite proportions, they give a neutral solution. The reaction of an acid with a base produces salt and water.